Hi YouTube and welcome to vlog number 62. I've almost made myself sick waiting for this package. It finally has arrived. And uh, although I've been waiting for what's in this package for 10 years now. I had this great awesome thing I was going to do for y'all with, uh, with uh, my badass knife. Like I did with the uh, sword thing. I'm just going to be completely honest with y'all. I'm going to get real for a minute. There's only two things in this world that excites me more than this package I'm about to open. One, huh? One <laughs> is when this baby boy runs up to me with a report card with all A's and a big grin on his face. Two, looking into those big, beautiful bread. Uh, turn that around there. Big, beautiful bedroom You're eyes. funny. You're really funny. With only two things. <laughs> You're that excite me more. But without further ado, we're going to do that. Open All right. Box. And it's it's late. It's late. So we don't know, people, how this is going to be. Hey, brother, come Easy. Right, the bot put to come yesterday. It come yesterday. So it come today. That's what we got. Ready, careful, Dad. Yeah, you better be careful, too. Mikey, back up a little bit, right baby. There. He's really got it in there. Whoa. That's the way you cut with that thing. Okay. Alright. Oh yeah, and I got my shout outs right. Now, I want to give a shout out to Jeepers Creepers Tarantulas. King Serpents. That's King with a K. <laughs> and Andrew's Tarantulas. I was right on Andrew's Tarantulas last night. <laughs> Right, we'll see. I noticed him going crazy over that. Yeah. Mikey, if Daddy's got a knife, you need to move your hands. Daddy's crazy with a knife. Watch out. Mikey. <laughs> Michael. Back up. Alright, now. Knife up, good. knife safe. Hey, tell me. <laughs> Get out of that. I'm gonna help you. Hold on a minute, hold on a minute. Easy, 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 easy. Right. Wow. Okay. Um, who are we getting this pack from? This is Palp Friction. Palp Friction, people. Look how this box is. Uh, come up here. Come up here. We gotta see all this because all this video has to be video oh, footage right. in order to no, in order to ensure. And the tarantula will bite your face off. Oh, Hold God. on. Hold, there, you won't believe what's in here. You better get back. Oh, no, Might no. be all loose in there. We don't know. Um, that that way, Palp Friction can see the video. We're doing this. Look at this. Well, so far, hold on. Heat pack, is that heat pack still warm? Uh -huh. Feel it. No, Feel no, it, see if it's still warm. No, no, heat pack. Get out of it, Daddy. You're not. <laughs> okay, no. heat pack's still warm. And no, that's no, some of the best not. foam I've ever seen in my life. On an unboxing. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mikey, back up, baby. Hold on, hold on. They're very fragile. These things are probably only about this big around. Mikey. I don't know. Back up, baby, please. You can't down there. Back up. Okay, he's got plenty of packing, but are you getting down on this? Yes, this? I'm getting. Plenty of packing. Oh, what's this? Oh, I see something in there. Awesome. Here is who this came from. I got me a new window decal, and I will be advertising with this thing. This thing got a stick. Here, good spot right there. No, crazy. <laughs> All right, let's see. Yeah, a lot paper out. Yeah, I thought he was gonna joke me around for a minute and give me what what the hell? look at these little bitty vials. Oh my god. I see. Oh my god, can y'all read what that says people? M Balfouri. This is one of the spiders I've been see, waiting Daddy. for for ten years. And there's two of them in this package. I see. When I first seen them when I first seen them these were like a thousand dollars for a sling. What? They're in there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You ain't gonna be able to see them for a while, baby. They're really, really tiny. Oh my god. Another 10 year spider I've been waiting for. Chromatopelma. Zaino. Uh. Zaino Pew Benzins. That's also known as the Green Bottle Blue Tarantula. Let's see. H. Metallica. I mean, H. Maculata. H. Mac, that's a uh, heteroscoter maculata. Also known as, if you look right here, 
the Togo Starburst Baboon. I left this sticker on here. Can you get up here and see? I left this sticker up here on this cage. That's not what, what's in there. But I left this right here because that's the first one I ever had. And there's some spider shit. Mikey got bored and left. Let's see you later. Oh my god, people. Oh my god. Postalatheria Metallica. The Goody Sapphire Ornamental Tarantula. Y'all y'all stick with me, because we're gonna be unboxing these. We're gonna be uh, putting these in here in a minute. Oh my god. There's all that stuff. Let's see. I gotta make sure I got all that I got. Alright, these. Here are the P. Arminia. That's the one. That's a freebie, I guess. That's the one that's got the little stripe on the knee that you were telling me I should get. So we got a free P. Arminia because that's not one I ordered. We got a Lassadora Peri Habana. A LP. So I have three LPs now. Awesome! So we got two free uh, freebies. Here's one that I ordered. An Acanthoscuria Geniculata. That is awesome. What is this here? Oh my god. We got a P. This is another freebie here, people. A P. Hanu. Mavalasalamica. Damn, I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm murdering that name. I'm gonna have to look that one up. That's also another freebie. And a Postletheria rufalata. So this is one I ordered. And the this I got three freebies. That is awesome. I highly recommend that if these spiders are alive, these people, <laughs> because this package has been. I don't know. It's late. I'm not gonna say mishandled. I don't know. But let's see what we got. Can you get comfortable so we can start unboxing some of this stuff over here somewhere? Let's get some light on the subject. Yeah, all kinds of sizes of all kinds and sizes of containers up here. Just in case. We already got the pokey. We'll probably do that one first. P Metallica. Oh yeah, and y'all can see here's the Socotra Island M. Balfouri Communal, which is kind of big, but uh... Do you want to do smaller ones? I don't know. I might start them out smaller. I might start them out in this, depending on, because they're really tiny, aren't they? Aren't they? Well, that one might be okay to... Oh, shit. This is a very, very fast... <laughs> and he's very very blue and he's very very right in my face oh. hmm. Hold. I'm falling in that thing so he's falling in that thing I said get comfortable she grabbed the basket with a hole in it yeah. um I'm just gonna stand in here you can sit here then I guess but I don't want this to jump on your face and then you run or kill it that's why I said right, I'm I would stand, stand there for one second let's see how many minutes are we at we're at eight minutes. Right, get over my shoulder. You can rest on my shoulder. Rest on my shoulder. Let's see. All right, this is the P. Metallica, people. Here. Zoom in on that. He appears to be alive. Um, give me some tweezers. Here, you can sit there and I'll stand. I need you comfortable where you can uh, watch this. Here, tongs. Here is the Goody Sapphire Ornamental Tarantula. I'm so excited I can't stand it. And he retreated. The Goody retreated. Sorry people, I don't know. Y'all think I'm doing this right or wrong, but it's going into this container. Been on that. 
What? Why are they going in this container? This is a Rufalata. Really? You ain't watching what I'm doing? I guess I bet everybody else is watching every move I'm making. Please help me. Here is the goodie. I want to get a good close up on this. I like slings and things. Whoa. It's a very healthy looking tea. Check it out, people. Zoom in on from the top. Get some light on here. Zoom in right through here from the top. I can't, you can't even see. You got to watch this what you're doing. Sorry, I got to get on her all the time, people. She don't watch what she's filming. She watches what I'm doing. All right, he's fat and healthy. All right. You watch out. We're going to put that on that coconut bark. I mean, on that, yeah. Cork bark. Come on, buddy. Alive and well, yes. I didn't expect to get three freebies either. It's very awesome. Of palp. And he is comfortable in his new home. Yep, right here. Right here, people. Now we gotta move on because we got a lot of stuff to unpackage. Woohoo! I'm like a kid in a candy store. Mm mm mm. That is awesome. Yep. I've been waiting for a long time for this. And here's a Canthoscuria geniculata. Got him a little bitty container too. And I'll be transferring him to this later. Oops. Are you filming what I'm doing or are you yes, filming this I'm stuff filming. over here while I'm over here? Okay, I want you right on the action. Don't even watch what I'm doing. Just watch this because that's what everybody's going to see. Canthoscuria geniculata number one. This is the first time I've ever had one of these type of pill bottles. These types of drams or whatever. Get my sharp tweezers. Itty gritty stuff. Whoa. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh my god. It's just a... I can't see. Give me that light. This light, this light. Look in there, people. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. He's in there. You can just barely see him. This is just little bitty tiny slings and things. How many minutes are we at? 12 minutes. What? All right, 12 minutes? Mm hmm. What the hell was that? A rock or something I just busted on here. Did you see that? Mm hmm. This is awesome way of packing, I got to say. This is one of the fastest growing. I hear, I've never had this species before. One of the fastest growing tarantulas, people. Wow, wow. And it's one of the fastest, I see. Whoa, look at him in there. Fast little turd. Watch, I'm gonna blow. Where's the lid? Where's the lid? Where's the lid? Right here. One Acanthoscuria geniculata down. Check that out. Awesome. Wow. Fast little turd. <clears throat> oh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, here's the H maculata. Two H Macs in here. Hey, look at this little H Mac container. That is awesome, isn't it? Tell me that ain't awesome, people. I'm probably gonna do the bigger ones, and then I'll uh, show y'all updates and stuff of these. I don't want to take up too much of y'all's time. This is absolutely amazing. Oh shit! Yeah, H Mac and H Mac. That one's got to go in there too. These are the containers that I got my. King Baboon's in from Underground. Whoa. Look in here. You know what? I might just sit it in there. Well, I don't know, maybe he'll come out. You think he'll come out? I don't know. I'm going to lose him. 
Let's see. Let's see. Another very fast tea, people. Oh, he's in there. Damn, did you get to see him? Oh, he's in there. There he is. Whole ass. He'll web all that stuff up. They like burrowing and stuff, but there he is back in the back. Togo Starburst Babu number one. And we got Togo Starburst Babu number two. Things couldn't go no smoother. They said they like burrowing. You got to give them a little bit of a burrow. A starter burrow. This is dried out a bit. So I'll give it a little bit of a little shot of water. And this is a prescription pill bottle my grandma used to have. She gave me before she died. And I had pumpkin patches in there. The munchkin pumpkin patch, the little bitty ones. Oh look, he's already webbed it. That is awesome. Pure awesomeness, people. This spider is very flighty and no one to be aggressive. When they get bigger. Not really a beginner species I don't think it was the very first one I ever got though because everybody said it's not a beginner species spider to spider and I figure if I want to get into spiders I'm going to get the baddest ass thing they had to offer to start with because if I got the baddest stuff they had to offer they can't ever surprise me with nothing any faster, flightier, or bitier and then my second one I got was an OBT years ago. Alright, you can see that spider in there. Hopefully we get him unraveled. Be able to get a look at him. Yep, look. Can you see him? Mm-hmm. That's what a baby H Mac looks like, people. He's going to his new temporary home. See how I'm pushing him down there? And how smooth that transaction was. You're not even filming him. Go more that way. Right there. Yep, there's his new home. Not much. Pretty simple in design. HMAC number two down. Oh, let's see what we got here. We had to get some little drams out. Here is, here, here is my green bottle blues. Which I was going to show y'all what was in here. I didn't know they were this small, so I'm going to start them out a little order, but this is my green bottle blue containers. These are screw jugs. I get my screws in, and I got some anchor points in there for these guys. So when we do the transfer, y'all leave in the comments below if you want to see the transfer of these guys when they get a little bit bigger. We're going to put them in there. Keep our fingers crossed that we got a male and a female. I got green bottle blue containers right here. These I got from the dollar store. I don't really like them because the lids are hard as hell to open. Yep, hard as hell to open. And I got just a little piece of stuff in here. Or should I put them in something bigger? Put them in these. Let's see what they look like. Then we'll decide. Them are pretty small, but they'd have some room. I don't have nothing, no anchor points, so. I might put them in here. Everything's alive and well so far, people. Um, considering everything went against us anyway, I would highly recommend Pelt Fiction. I'm already going to reorder with them. Thank you, everyone at Pelt Fiction. Pelt Friction. Oh, these are bigger than what I thought. Oh, my God. You guys are in for a treat. Let's stick some toothpicks or something in there. I have an anchor point. It might be big enough to go in there. If it's big enough to go in there, we will transfer and transfer. This is Chromatopelma. Check that out. Chromatopelma Cyanio Pubenzin, I believe. Shit, where's the fucking thing at? I don't know where it is. What? A container with the word. Chromatopelma 
It's uh, Anio Pew Benzins. What a name. What a name. Whoa. Yeah, that's big enough to go in our other container. So that's exactly where they're going to go. That is a bigger spider than what I purchased, people. Look at that. Oh, my God. Get a, get a close-up on that spider. You're out of the frame. Put it in the center. Put it in the center. Absolutely beautiful tarantula, people. The green bottle blue. I'm going to be updating you guys periodically on this here. This. We are going to put these guys in here. How many? How much time are we at? Uh, 20 minutes and 40, 50 seconds. I better hurry up with it. Um, Y'all be sure to check out those channels that I shouted out. Sub to them, if you will. It don't hurt you to go to sub somebody. It's always it means nice to help everybody out. Help here we go. people out. There we go. This is going in here. Oh, look at him right there on his log. Awesome. Oh, that little thing. So precious. I will number label these. I'm very excited about that. Can't wait to see these web up. These are very heavy webbers. They're absolutely awesome. Badass MVP and cool. Highly recommended as a beginner species for me. You might have a little bit hotter venom, but then you're be Brachypomas and stuff, but it doesn't matter. Where's the other one like it? That's it. Mm -hmm. The containers are cool. Whoa, look at him. Nope, nope, nope. No, he didn't. Like my daddy, I did. Really, these are really bitey. I hear. Trying to get him in his thing. Look at that. He's so freaking cute. Oh my god. Just because of the way this spider is acting, I'm definitely gonna get another order in for palp friction. Palp friction. This is awesome. This will not be a tea I'll be handling. Just so y'all know, he's just a little baby thing. Oh. Oh, that is so precious. These are fast growers or medium growers, and they're gonna love their new enclosure, people. Um, let me see what else I got. What else do I got to open? Open. They like a dry. They're easy to take care of because they like it dry. I'm keeping it moist a little bit because they're slings. I'm gonna let this whole container dry out, and then I'm going to give them a water bowl and keep it, let it overflow every now and then in one corner. But keep them dry because of the simple fact that they are a desert species. They prefer it dry. What else do I got? Here's the Mbalfori. I'm going to put them in here. Little bitty Balfouris. And I got two of them to put them as a communal. I've been wanting these forever, but they are so expensive. And oh, the reason I, t I titled this... The rarest and biggest because the Postletheria metallica, the Goody Sapphire Ornamental, is the rarest tree spider tarantula on the planet. And the, whatever it is, where is it? The Rufalata is the biggest, largest tarantula tree tarantula on the planet. Whoa. Why don't you just set them in there? And Balfouri, look in here. Monocytotropus Balfouri. Yep. Whoa. Let me get out of that. Yeah, they can work their way out. Yeah, to hurry up the video. We'll put them two right there. So I can look at them periodically and see when they come out. With the lid securely on there. These are very fast. If y'all get this species, know 
they teleport and you will lose them if you're not careful pokey winner let's do the roof a lot of next and these other three i'll just show y'all as an update and an updated video we're going to do the roof a lot of this one does have a hot venom not a handleable spider oh and it's huge already <laughs> let's see this is the roof a lot of container right This is also known yeah. as the red slate ornamental. Yep. I want to get this one out though so that people can see it. Postletaria rufula. I have a postletaria fascietta, a postletaria metallica, and a rufalata now. Three of them. Three different pokies in my collection. Three very amazing pokies. I love them. We had, well, I had over 30 Pocalotheria Metallica, including 10 pr pregnant ones, and they're very hard to breed. Not very many people on the planet know how to breed them. I do know how to breed them, and I'm going to again. But uh, the children and families cost me that when they took my son and. Uh, Told me to get rid of them and they died in transit and I never put them on here. I was going to offer them to everyone at a more affordable price. I'd been breeding them for years. But, sad story's over and when uh, something happens, something else happens. So I'm very happy and excited about what we've got here. I don't know a lot. He can't get out of there, can he? You always want to take your spider compared to the holes on the container. I don't think that spider can get out of there. Time will tell, people. If he does, Bud will eat him. That would suck. Are these Balfouris doing anything? They came out and then they went back in. Alright, that's fine. Here. Hold that. This is a communal setup. And they're very awesome. How many minutes are we at? 27. 27. I'm going to... Uh, Research these things. I'll transfer these two off of film. I'm gonna go ahead and put my LP in here. This will be LP number three. I have three of them now. You little bitty tiny thing. Thank you so much, Palp Friction, for my freebies. And, and the guy has been in constant contact with me. He even sent me a message saying that he wished he was there that he, he was gonna hand select my um, tees. But he says people did a good job. I hope you watch this video. And uh, yes, your people did a good job. And also, An not only job. that, they called and they wrote us to let us know that they wasn't going to be able to send us the spiders. Yes, constantly. Been in constant but contact. Then, on the day that they were supposed to, because they had a bad snowstorm. Yep. And all of and y'all were asked if that. it was okay, and we Aww. said that was fine. Look, people. In a year from now, this thing's going to be the size of a paper plate. Ain't that awesome? So I have three of these now, and that's fine with me, palp friction. I don't mind having multiples of species. It gives me better odds of having males and females. So this is number three LP. Number three LP. And we'll go ahead and uh, mark that LP number three. Third one's a charm. That must be my male, hopefully. A little cute thing. Oh, oh, that's so precious. This one species, I don't, I'm not sure what this is. I've probably seen it, but I don't know. But I'm going to definitely check it out. And I'll update y'all on another one. There's a PR Minya, another favorite of mine. I used to have these, and I don't have none now except this one. This is my first of this, and I had an LP. Thank you so much, people. Peace, love, and happiness, and all that good shit. Like, subscribe, tell your friends. Stay tuned because we are going to be doing more of this. Edward Tyndall out scar shedding and so is sunshine, sunshine shedding. I'll update them later bye